Welcome to the setting video. What up, dude? Morning, YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Today, uh, we're going to be doing a little setting video for Ooh. you guys that want to know a little bit about uh, the setting process. We're here at Arch North. I'm going to set on this wall behind us. Probably going to go for like, like a V5, V6, centered around this big x cult volume hold. I love this hold. It's, it's like the biggest hold we own. Apart from that, that white wing, uh, it's really cool. It very like versatile and very light. Looks like a really fucked up nipple. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Sweet. Cool, let's do it. Start out down here on uh, with volumes his feet. And I'm going to push up into this guy. Push up into it so you, you won't be able to reach the top and pull on it. And hopefully you won't be able to jump to it and catch it. I'm going to push up into it, walk your feet around this side wall, uh, and then maybe turn this into a palm and finish somewhere oh. up there. So I want to walk on volumes across, across the lower half. Because the hand above you is not going to be so good, I need to make sure the volumes are uh, the volumes protrude enough from the wall. Mm. So hopefully you'll be able to stand on these on these tips. Uh, I tried this one and it's, it's less likely. It's going to be way way harder. You'll need something to pull on to stand on these. So there are two ways that holes and volumes are attached to walls. One is with screws, like this volume, and the other is with bolts. For these blocks volumes we just use uh, 50 mil screws. This volume has got like eight screw holes. Mm. Bang the screw in, fix it to the plywood. The plywood is, I think, like three quarter inch deep ply. It's hard ply, so it's, yeah, they're never gonna come off the wall, it's so strong. So you can, you, can, you can drill anywhere into that wall, it's totally cool. Yeah, anyway, cool. as long as you don't drill through these T-nuts. Yeah. Okay, cool. I'll tell you what a T-nut is in a minute. Yeah, please do. I just said bolt hole, and I don't think that's correct. Cool. <laughs> One screw and it'll hold it on. It's just pressure don't. and friction. <laughs> don't climb it. <laughs> Two screws. Fine. Climbable. Make sure you put all of them in there. As I said, my idea changes organically. Like a true artiste. I'm thinking you're going to have the, the big red blob on the left hand side and you sort of walk your feet up, yeah. up and up and up and up and up. And then I don't want to do a palm down rollover because we always do palm down rollover. Yeah. It's the best move in climbing. But. Um, so I want, so it's going to need to be further left. If your feet are on this volume mm. and it was here, you're going to be all punched up. So if it's further out, You'll be able to get horizontal and then get over it. Usually when we're setting, we don't need to pull on until we, we test later on. Mm. Uh, I like to keep my chalk out and just feel feel the moves because I don't really know how this one's going to go. It's a little bit of an experiment. Show me, bro. Yeah, we'll Show me what you got. Cool, wow. Not at all what I expected. That needs to be lower. I think I need to I need to get above it to, to manipulate my feet higher. I need to get above this quite early. Oh, maybe. maybe there's something there. If you come and touch lower. Yeah. It's You're like lower. an archaeologist of roots. Yeah. Are you digging it out? You're digging them boulders out. Digging in the garbage. <laughs> How do you not die every day from climbing so much? Have you just become super strong as fuck since setting? Oh, I, I've definitely become fitter. Yeah. Uh, it takes its toll though. If you do more than three days setting in a row, you are fucked. At least I am. <laughs> a friend of Nikki's. A friend of Nikki's set for something like 198 days straight in what? Germany. Why? I don't know. I don't know how he did it. It's not German perseverance, dude. It's not. Because the wall overhangs slightly, mm. um, walking your feet along loader volumes and then turning it out is, is too hard. So I've made a turn this so it's the better side and I've made this foot better. 
This is what's called a meltdown. You got pressure. Pressure, pressure. Pressure, pressure. pressure to set a good block on camera. Oh, that's not, that's not Sometimes pressure, bro. All your blocks are amazing. You need to come in with the, the, the knowledge of exactly what move you're gonna set. And if you don't know, then you often have a meltdown. Mm. Are you, it's easy to get sucked into the trap of like picking really cool holds. Being like, oh, I know all these moves. I don't know which one to use, but I'm just going to start putting them on a wall and yeah. see how they interact. And this is kind of one of those and then you get cases. Up, lost in the fog. Like this, this isn't a bad move. It's just not as interesting as I wanted it. I'm going to talk about bolts and how long they should be and what they do and how they fix holds to the wall. So um, each, when you look at a wall, each of these little holes, these holes in the back of them, they have what's called a T nut. This is a T nut. It's like a retaining. Uh, a retaining nut with the, the opposite thread to a, a bolt. Um, so when you put a bolt through the hole, do you want to make sure you've got, I don't know, about just over like a thumb's depth sticking out? You want to make sure that it's going to go through the wall and through the T-nut in its entirety. So it's strong, yeah? So this is the finished article, uh, finished-ish. Uh, I'm not completely happy with it, but I kind of never am happy mm. with it. It needs to be perfect. You come out to this, yeah. uh, undercut, you match it, you roll with the right hand, and you do a, a flick to the, the finishing, finishing jug. It's kind of short and sweet, but I think it's got enough punch in it to be V4, V5 maybe. Cool. Let's see how it goes. A little easy. How do you uh, how do you decide on grades? Is it just from experience of climbing yeah. a shit ton? Just from feel, like would it fit in a yellow circuit or would it fit in a green circuit? Mm. Um, this doesn't make sense if you don't climb at the arch, but to me that feels like it could fit in the top end of a yellow circuit, which would make it like a V4. So the bottom end of the red circuit as well. Yeah. Yeah. Once we've once we've set all the boulders, we hit all the blocks. We have lunch come back like an hour later, all fresh, and we test everything in order. We make sure we've got a good spread uh, of grades and a good good spread of styles. So we don't want all slopers and pinches. We want some crimps in there as well. We don't want massive moves. We want lots of technical moves too. We want a bit of everything. Uh, I've moved the finish hold further away and I've turned this, this right hand into more of a Gaston. Uh, so hopefully the last move should be a bit bigger. Let's see. I'll give it one more trial run and then I'm gonna have to move on. Cool. Gotta go. Oh! What happened there, buddy? I don't know where I hit. I need to see the, I need to see the playback. <laughs> oh, very slick, my friend. Oh, it's definitely not shit. <laughs> That's the... I think it looks good, man. Good. Uh, your idea changed a lot from the beginning. Were you happy with what you've done? Yeah, it, it still focuses around this. Yeah. You use it as the start hold and you use it as the finish foot. So it's still focusing around one hold, which I'm happy about. Yeah, it's, it's turned out okay. It took too long though. It's a fucking meltdown. The pressure, man, the pressure. Okay. A little insight into how we set at the arch, or how I set at the arch. Yeah. But everyone's different, like, if you watch Holly set, you'll see something completely different. Cool. Look at what Holly set. Look at those boxes. Woo! 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 Jeez! Woo! Cool. Okay, uh, thank you for watching. Uh, make sure you like, hit that like button. Ring the ding, the Ooh. bell. That's a new. Is that that's new? I don't know. Yeah, if it's a new know. feature. We're trying to but be YouTube, I don't hit know. the bell and uh, leave us a comment. Cool. Tell us if you liked it. Tell us if you want to see something more. Sweet. Thanks for watching. Bye. Cool.